love story is kind of like a real life fairy tale. Um, but during the time they spent together, she was the center of his world. He adored her because she was so silly and so goofy, just like he was. You know, I think about it kind of close thing that my dad would have wanted for her. I and mean, I think he would have wanted somebody that was kind and somebody that's hardworking, somebody that is generous and like you are all those things and so much more. Seriously, we're all so lucky to have you in our family. You know that saying, march to the beat of your own drum? Well, I'm not sure I ever fully understood that until I met Mike. Not only do I physically look up to him, but I've also seen him grow as a person over the last decade. And it's awesome to see that he has found someone to share his life with. Mike, I mean it when I say I'm proud of the man you become. And on the list of things you've done so far in life, having Nora has to be near the top. And Emmy, when Amanda and I left for Colorado, we were a little bit worried about leaving Mike on his own, but we're thankful he came into his life when he did, and are here now to give Mike the push that we all know he sometimes needs. Emily and Michael, you have professed your love by exchanging your vows. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Michael, you may kiss your bride.